Hey welcome, to another After Effects tutorial. So today, we are going to see how to create an amazing transition inside After Effects. Also, in this tutorial we are going to talk about many tricks and techniques, to make workflow easy and smooth. So, let's see what we are going to create today. Let's begin, here we are inside After Effects, start with new project, create new composition. Let's rename it to transition. Also, I'll keep this default settings, and duration to 3 seconds. And hit OK. Now, right click and create new adjustment layer. Now. Go to Effects and Presets, and search for Motion Tile. And drag it to this layer. Set its output width and height to 200%. Also enable this mirror edges. Let's create markers, simply press star, on keyboard. Make sure, we are going to place keyframes only at this point. I have created here three markers. With help of this we can easily organize our transition. Also deselect layers, and create marker on this time ruler, at one second. Double click on this marker, and let's label this to transition. Now search for transform. and drag it to this adjustment layer. Now drag this time indicator bar here. And click stopwatch of scale. This will create a keyframe. Now, go at 1 second, and set its value to 300. Now move this time indicator bar to here, and set its value to 100. Again, move this time indicator bar here. And click stopwatch of rotation, to create new keyframe. Now place this bar here. And set its value to 1. Now search for tint. And drag it to this layer. Place time indicator bar here and click on stopwatch of amount to tint, and set its value to 0. Move this to 1 seconds forward, and set its value to 100. And at this point, set its value back to 0. Now search for CC lens. And drag it to this layer. Place this time indicator bar here. And click stopwatch of size. And set its value to 500. Move this to 1 seconds forward. And now set its value to 100. Again move this time indicator bar here. And set its value to 500. Place this time indicator bar here. Now click stopwatch of convergence. And set its value to zero. Go one seconds forward in time at marker point. And set its value to 100. Now place this time indicator bar here. And set its value to zero. Cool. Now search for radial blur. and drag it to this adjustment layer. Now drag this time indicator bar here, and click stopwatch of amount, 
and set its value to 0. Now place this time indicator here and set its value to 10. Now move this to here and set its value back to 0. So, here we are done with keyframing. Now click on this adjustment layer and press U. It will reveal all keyframes which we just made. Now select all keyframes, right click and easy ease them. Now we are going to adjust the animation speed using Graph Editor. To make things simple, we are going to adjust the animation speed of each property separately. Let's select these first. And click on this Graph Editor. Make sure you enable this Edit Speed Graph. Also click here, to fit Graph to View. Now, select this part. And drag this bar completely. And move this bar to this corner. Do this same at this opposite side too. Move this bar to corner. and drag this completely. We are going to do same graph animation to all other properties. As you can see, we have created this marker, so, we are going to make the transition gradually increase this animation speed at this point, and transition this out in a very smooth way. Once you done with adjusting graph animation speed. Now click on this project tab, and create new composition, also set its duration according to your video length, I'll set it to 10 seconds, and hit OK. Now drag your clips, and place it in this timeline. Let's move this clip to somewhat here, where you want to create the transition. Now drag this transition comp and timeline. And move it to this point, where we have labeled our marker as transition, so at this point transition will take place. Also, double click on this transition comp, and enable this motion blur. Make sure you enable this, otherwise transition won't work. So, here we have created this seamless transition, let's preview this. Awesome! So this way we have created this transition in After Effects, also, we have created a set of 6 seamless transition, to make your workflow fast. You can download it, link in description. If this tutorial helped you, press the like button, and subscribe for more new contents every week. See you in next tutorial, stay tuned.